Greetings, gastronomies. Welcome to our channel, your beacon in the vast expanse of delightful dining experiences. Our mission is simple, to guide you through the labyrinth of tantalizing tastes and enchanting eateries, from the little-known gems to the universally acclaimed hotspots. Whether you're a fan of the traditional or the avant-garde, the familiar or the exotic, we've got you covered. We journey through an array of cuisines, exploring the myriad flavors that make up the culinary cosmos. From the rustic trattorias of Italy to the bustling food stalls of Bangkok, from the elegant bistros of Paris to the vibrant taquerias of Mexico City, we're here to bring you the creme de la creme of global gastronomy. So join us as we embark on this Epicurean adventure. Today, we're diving into the vibrant, flavorful world of Vietnamese cuisine, right here in the city of Angels, Los Angeles. Vietnamese cuisine, a symphony of flavors, textures, and colors, has garnered global recognition. This culinary tradition is a perfect blend of sweet, sour, salty, and spicy, creating an intricate balance that's as delightful to the palate as it is to the eye. The uniqueness of Vietnamese cuisine lies in its emphasis on fresh ingredients, from the vibrant herbs that garnish a bowl of fuor to the crunchy vegetables that fill a spring roll, freshness is paramount. In fact, most dishes are prepared with minimal cooking, preserving the natural flavors and nutrients of the ingredients. This cuisine also champions a harmonious blend of flavors. Take a bite of any Vietnamese dish and you'll likely detect the sweetness of sugar, the sourness of citrus, the saltiness of fish sauce, and the heat of chili. This complexity and balance of taste is a testament to the culinary artistry that's been perfected over thousands of years. And let's not forget the health benefits. Vietnamese food is known for being low in fat and high in nutrients. It's a diet that heavily features lean proteins, fiber-rich vegetables, and healthy herbs. Even the most indulgent dishes are often accompanied by a side of fresh greens, maintaining a balance between pleasure and well-being. The diversity in Vietnamese cuisine mirrors the country's diverse geography and culture. From the hearty fur beef noodle soup of the north to the vibrant kuam tom broken rice dishes of the south, each region contributes a unique flavor profile to the rich tapestry of Vietnamese food. But Vietnamese cuisine is more than just a collection of delicious dishes. It's a reflection of the country's history, culture, and people. It's an art form, a tradition, and a way of life. Now, Let's embark on a culinary journey to discover the top 10 Vietnamese eateries in LA. With the abundant of good Vietnamese restaurants in LA, it's very hard to choose just the top 10. In this video, we compile a list of different Vietnamese food in LA. I'm sure we left out some local favorites, so please post a comment for your favorite Vietnamese restaurants in the LA area. Rest assured, we'll have the location below in the description, so you don't have to go searching on the internet. Kicking off our countdown at number 10 is 487. If you know, you know, this nondescript restaurant at the edge of Chinatown is home to some of LA's best fur. With a deep, almost funkily beefy taste, 487's delicious namesake has drawn hungover Angelinos from near and far on late weekend mornings. But even the stone-cold sober will appreciate the affordable, steaming hot bowls of noodle soup. The family-run shop also offers a solid array of Kai V or appetizers and combination plates with your choice of rice, vermicelli, or banh hoi. But the reason to come to this lonely and desolate stretch of North Broadway is the four. At number nine is Vin Loy Tofu. Vin Loy is a star of the vegan scene in LA. When Kevin and Lynn opened their business in 2002, they exclusively made tofu in the space but since have branched out to offer everything from banh mi sandwiches to duck noodle salads and a curry udon stir-fry. Kevin calls his cuisine strictly Vietnamese food, but my style. Vin Loi is a casual cafe, no reservations necessary. The orange and green walls display large photos of the menu items. News clippings, accolades, and recognitions from the city of Los Angeles and the California State Senate are hanging on the walls. You sit down wherever you choose, but your order is at the discretion of the chef. There are more than 300 items on the menu, but the food changes. Every two weeks, there's something new and different. At number eight is Blossom Restaurant located in Santa Monica, a chic, modern restaurant that offers a fresh take on traditional Vietnamese cuisine. 
You'll like Blossom for its food, but you'll love it for its owner, Duke Farm. Duke is a Swiss knife at Blossom, bouncing from chef, bartender, interior designer, and sommelier. Ask for a table in the basement and you'll see his glass-walled wine cellar. Start off with some goi quan, shrimp and pork spring rolls with a side of peanut sauce, or spice it up with bo quan, beef spring rolls with a hint of lemongrass in the beef marinade. Follow with any of the fur, although the fur thai, rare steak, is a must for meat eaters. Pair it with cafe suadilla, Vietnamese iced coffee with condensed milk, a local beer, or browse through Duke's extensive wine list. Born in Vietnam as the youngest of nine siblings, Duke immigrated after the war in dangerous conditions, which went from a shipwreck to living on a Malaysian island's beach until they were rescued by the U.S. Navy. Duke Farm told LA Weekly, It was the best time of my life on that island. Everything after that, everything now, is just a bonus. The interior is sleek and minimalistic, creating a serene dining atmosphere. Blossom's menu sees familiar Vietnamese staples reimagined with a contemporary twist. The standout here is their vegan pour, a robust, fragrant broth packed with tofu and a medley of vegetables. Even the most avid meat lovers find themselves coming back for more of this plant-based delight. Customer reviews highlight the innovative menu and attentive service, solidifying Blossom's place in the top 10. These eateries set the bar high, but the journey's only just begun. Before we proceed, if you're enjoying our culinary journey, do consider subscribing to our channel. By doing so, you won't miss out on any of our tantalizing food escapades. And if you're already enchanted by the vibrant Vietnamese cuisine we're exploring, don't hesitate to hit that like button and share this video with your fellow food enthusiasts. Remember to turn on notifications so you'll be first in line when our new content drops. Now, back to our delicious voyage through LA's Vietnamese dining scene. Continuing our countdown, at number seven, we have the underrated Nem Nuong Can Hoa. Located in the Alhambra, California, this culinary gem is known for its delectable Nem Nuong, a traditional Vietnamese grill BBQ pork patties. You have the option of roll your own roll dish or pre-made Nem Nuong roll. If you decided to go with the former, it comes with rice paper, noodles, herbs, and of course, Nem Nuong or grilled BBQ pork patties. Then you can go at it and make your own roll of Nem Nuong. They also known for their Bun Bo We or spicy beef noodle soup. If you go here, come with cash since that's the only form of payment accepted. The cozy, homely atmosphere and the warm, welcoming staff make dining here a truly delightful experience. Customers often rave about the quality of the food and the generous portions, making it a favorite among food enthusiasts. Continuing our countdown, at number six, we have the Ban Quan Tejo. There are several locations in Southern California. The one in Westminster is called Ban Quan Tejo 4. Ban Quan is originated in North Vietnam and is made with thinly steamed rice crepe. Tejo is the West Lake in Hanoi, hence the name Ban Quan Tejo. Many Vietnamese choose to begin their day with a plate of Ban Quan, steamed rice crepe. It's technically wide, paper-thin sheets of steamed rice batter with a filling of minced wood ear mushrooms, shallots, and well-seasoned ground pork. It's usually topped with a few sprinkles of crispy fried shallots for an extra crunch and a to-die-for fragrance. Just like other dishes in Vietnam, Bang Quan is served with fresh herbs such as mint and coriander, and you'll also get a specially made fish dipping sauce which is slightly sweet and slightly salty. You can't go wrong with Ban Quan Te Ho. The service is quick and the Ban Quan is melt in your mouth. We're halfway through our list and the gastronomic delights keep coming. Moving up the ranks, at number five, we find Quan Mi. Quan Mi is a Vietnamese restaurant in Westminster, California, that some say has the best Bang Sio in California and Orange County and is their favorite place for it. Ban Sheo is a Vietnamese stuffed rice pancake that translates to sizzling cake because of the sound the batter makes when it hits the pan. The result is a thin, crispy yellow crepe with caramelized edges that's filled with shrimp, pork, mushrooms, and bean sprouts. It's served with rice paper and plentiful of herbs. To eat this delicacy, you break a small piece of ban chio, then wrap it together with the herbs in the rice paper. Dip your roll creation in the dipping sauce made of fish sauce that has been diluted with water, sugar, and lime. 
Don't forget to sample the Bombillo, it's one of the best in town. Moving up the ranks, at number 4, we find Kuum Tom Tuan Q. This gem, located in the heart of Little Saigon in a strip mall right on Bolsa Ave, is well known for its Kam Tam or broken rice in English. This low-key spot doesn't have the big crowds or high energy of some of the surrounding restaurants. That's one of the best thing about it. This is the kind of place you come to after a long day, sit in blissful silence, and eat an $11.99 platter of broken rice, broken rice grains, topped with seven different items that range from grilled pork to egg rolls to tofu shrimp paste. But perhaps the best thing about a meal at Kum Tom is the fact you'll have leftovers tomorrow. If you haven't had Kum Tom before, it is a signature dish of South Vietnam and a staple of Saigon. The dish's taste is determined by Suan Nuong, which is pork chops marinated in honey, salt, fish sauce, oyster oil, pepper, sliced garlic, sesame oil and smashed fried onion, and cha trung, which is a steamed mixture of ground pork with vermicelli and wood ear. Kum Tam has a deep history that begins with the farmers of the Mekong Delta. It was commonly made into animal feed or rice flour and consumed by farmers or Vietnamese families on a tight budget. The dish symbolizes the hardships during the country's war and colonization up to its urbanization in the 20th century. But now the dish becomes one of the delicious Vietnamese delicacy. Moving up the ranks, at number three, we find Golden Deli Vietnamese. Nestled in the bustling neighborhood of San Gabriel, this restaurant has been serving up authentic Vietnamese dishes since the early 80s. Their specialty is the banh mi sandwich, a mouth-watering combination of fresh baguette, pickled vegetables, and grilled meat. Although, it was never supposed to be a Vietnamese restaurant in the first place. LA's current go-to for bowls of four and deep-fried egg rolls began as a fast, casual Chinese joint. The year was 1981 in the San Gabriel Valley, NASA launched its first space shuttle mission, Robert Redford won Best Director at the Oscars, and, in a sprawling cluster of neighborhoods east of Los Angeles, Chinese immigrants began to move in unprecedented numbers to Alhambra, El Monte, Rosemead, and Monterey Park. In an attempt to cater to the growing neighborhood, Golden Deli started as a grab-and-go buffet of Americanized favorites, but when business slowed, the owners pivoted to familiar foods from their home country, Vietnam. The decor is reminiscent of a traditional Vietnamese street market, with colorful lanterns adorning the ceiling and vintage photos gracing the walls. Patrons praise the restaurant for its generous portions and the authenticity of the dishes, bringing a slice of Vietnam to the heart of LA. The menu has hundreds of items, but glance around at the other tables and you'll start to sense a theme. The cha geo, or deep fried egg rolls, are a must. Rice wrappers, blistered to the point of cracking, are filled with ground pork and served with bright green lettuce and herbs. Like every other customer, you will need a bowl of fior. It's the house specialty, a slow cooked elixir filled with ribeye, fish balls, brisket, tendon, and or tripe. To achieve that signature flavor that can absolutely cure a nasty cold, giant vats of broth are cooked in kettles for hours, simmering a clean, clear brew using beef bones, onions, star anise, fennel seeds, cinnamon, and cardamom. It is soup, perfected. Complete your meal with a Vietnamese iced coffee, a sweet drink laced with condensed milk. But beware, these drinks are strong. If caffeine in the afternoon destroys your REM cycle, stick with water or tea. The restaurant is open every day except for Wednesday. Moving up the ranks, at number two we find Little Sister DTLA. This gem, located in the heart of LA downtown, is smallish place with about 50 seats, but nicely billed out. This restaurant has a new modern twist to Vietnamese dishes. Banh mi was the best, and at $1.08 it's a bargain. The SGV special with Vietnamese cold cuts, grilled pork, peanuts, pate, and the normal veggies served on a fresh roll with a nice crust. It's a good-sized sandwich, larger than most, and it's served with a small bowl of fur broth. The quality of the ingredients was ahead of the normal banh mi sandwiches in Little Saigon. The decor is modern and chic, with a touch of traditional Vietnamese elements, creating a comfortable and inviting atmosphere. Ifu noodle was another hit. Obviously house-made, they were a little thick and had a nice chew, and they were served with twice-cooked pork belly. 
the crunchy texture of the pork belly was fabulous, and the salty slash gamey slash smoky flavor was well suited to the slightly sweet sauce on the noodles. Customers rave about the friendly service and the consistency of the food quality, making it a must visit for any Vietnamese food lover. Finally, the moment we've all been waiting for, the crown jewel of Vietnamese dining in LA is the one and only, Four Filet. This establishment was named the top 10 by timeout.com quoted timeout.com. The hospitality might be blunt and to the point here, but the namesake soup is second to none at this longtime fewer specialist with outposts in Rosemead and South El Monte, the latter named Faux Filet too. At Four Filet, Northern style fur gets pared down to the essentials an aromatic, soulful broth with depth accrued from long simmered bones, slightly softer, wide, flat noodles, and your choice of beef cuts. The final, exquisitely simple result is adorned with a smattering of herbs, has an ideal scallion to soup ratio, and includes thin slivers of ginger that ultimately illuminate a perfect beef sunset in a bowl. The restaurant also boasts a selection of other Vietnamese favorites, such as the com tam or broken rice dish, bun or vermicelli dish, as well as the fairly hard to find com garoti or the succulent Cornish game hen atop tomato enriched red rice is the Vietnamese take on rotisserie chicken. Each dish is crafted with the freshest ingredients and an undeniable passion for Vietnamese cuisine. But what truly sets four filet apart is the rave reviews it's received. Patrons gush about the delicious food. Some even claim it's like being transported straight to Vietnam. A dining experience here is nothing short of a culinary adventure through the heart of Vietnam. So these were the top 10 Vietnamese restaurants in Los Angeles, each offering a unique slice of Vietnam's rich culinary heritage. From the vibrant, bustling heart of Restaurant 10, serving up traditional street food with a modern twist, to the elegant tranquility of Restaurant 1, where each dish is a work of art, we've savored a diverse range of flavors and experiences. Some restaurants took us on a journey through the country's regional cuisines, while others showcased the fresh natural ingredients that are the backbone of Vietnamese gastronomy. Restaurants Eight Blossom Restaurant and Two Little Sister DTLA introduced us to the innovative chefs pushing the boundaries of what's possible in the kitchen. And finally, our top pick encapsulated the best of all these elements, delivering a dining experience that was nothing short of extraordinary. Thank you for joining us on this flavorful journey. Until next time, keep exploring, keep eating, and keep enjoying the culinary delights that the world has to offer.